I've got to be at school in an hour. I don't want to go. Just want to go back to sleep. I didn't realize I'd have to deal with CV traffic. I forgot this even happens. Holy moly. I do not miss this. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I am starving. My stomach was rumbling the whole time I was taking that test. I did good on English, scored like a 101. I don't know why I did that. I did horrible on math. Math has always been my worst subject. Signing up for classes. Ugh. I don't like that part. Just gotta jump through hoops to get going. Suck source, max source. Fancher. I need some hand sanitizer because schools are gross. The test was computer based and other scholars in the room were sneezing like on their hands and using the computers still. Come on man, sneeze into your shoulder like that. So who knows? What nasties are on those keyboards and mouses? Those testing desks and computers are really unergonomic. They've got a space where you can put your paper. The mouse is shoved way forward, so you got to go like this with your mouse, and then back here with the keyboard. I'm driving with no hands. Bad habit. But that and the monitors are under the desks. So you gotta stare down the whole time. That test took three hours, holy crap. I was the last one in the testing room. It's usually like that for me. I'm slow. I'm going to get a burger. Choo choo. Choo choo. Choo choo in. Choo choo. Choo choo in. Burlington Northern Santa Fe. I like trains. My dad got me into the trains when I was younger. We had a model railroad in the basement. And he had a friend who had a extremely large model railroad in his basement, which spanned several rooms. This is the entire basement. Perdinkle! Fire truck! That model railroad was a sight to behold. It was extremely realistic, and there were a lot of coffee shops go there, it's not just drive the trains around the track. Yeah, there were actually cards, all organized, sorted by level of difficulty. And it's basically a game, you know, it's a challenge. You've got to take this load from the yard to a grain silo. Drop off that one car, it's in the middle of your consist, so you've got to separate the cars, do some, do some shuffling back and forth, and then reconnect consists that you're taking somewhere else. You gotta drop off this next car at another location. Then you've gotta pick up some cars and take them back to the yard. That whole process would take hours. And the challenge you were given was just hard. It was a shame when that friend passed away. He was an older gentleman. His layout was packed apart and given a giving away to people in pieces. It's a shame that that happened. It, it would have been awesome if that could stay there. It would be like a museum or something. When you were done with your challenge for the evening, uh, you'd sit down and Phil would always just kind of give you a, uh, like a interior. He'd just give you a life lesson. Just impart some words of wisdom. And he'd always give us a gift at the end of the evening. It'd usually be like a, mo a model railroad car or a book. Oh, he was the coolest guy. That's life, I guess. Alright, where are we going for lunch? I'm gonna slide down to five guys. Spokane, says US Robotics Atlas of the United States.
OB care. Original birth care you'll love. Perdinkle! What the heck, man? Respect your car lights. Well, 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 well. Do crime, do time, says the faded bump sticker. Bump sticker? It's bumper sticker. Can we make it through this light? Yeah, we can. Oh my goodness. Oh my damn. I am going to five guys. I'm gonna get a burg. Burr. This used to be a movie rental place. <laughs> I remember when those were around. Bite the fry. I can't do it. Oh my goodness. Oh my. I got me a strong burger. It is really windy out. Holy crap. I couldn't finish it. Then again, it was a normal size, which is two patties. And I got it all the way, which is almost all their toppings. Just got up from taking a nap. Boy, do I feel rested! It's Mickey Mouse. Don't do Mickey Mouse. A while back I went on fanfiction.net, I think it is, and I chose something random on there and recorded myself reading it. The door shook at the force. The tone of the voice seemed to be impatient. Let me see something important here! Olive! Come on, wake up and unlock this door! You knocked over the door? Olive yelled as she jerked out of her bed and ran to check the door? Of course not. I used my blink pool. Brain limiters were for people of normality. They, they were birds seeking for the sky. sky. That's my favorite quote. Kajuma had his Hagel magician. My sister posted this to Twitter. It's Jason Mraz, I guess. Well, I just had to follow up with this. My space. Uh, double jointed elbow. I love this song. See how many times I've played it? <laughs> and I need to play it again because it just ended. She does exist! Too bad she's taken. Check out my new camera that I'm about to buy. I've had enough of this audio desynchronization. It's my phone's fault. I thought it was my video editor's fault, but it's actually my phone's fault. I'm upgrading. Oh, Crystal Castles! It's expensive! I spent lots of money! It was like 200 bucks on that. I'm just regretting it. Buying it, because... Trying to save for a Mac, that's why. So that's going to set me back a bit. But, I really did need a better camera. It's too late, I bought it. It's happening. Mexico? Pizza? How do you say pizza in Spanish? I'm out of paper towels. Here's a tissue. Thanks. <laughs> now to cut this. All right. So good. Want to touch the hiney? Much obliged.